I would tell people who believe that this epidemic is not affecting them is to just wait. It will affect you at some point, especially in light of the fact that we've had so many individuals who have been impacted by this, by this disease. Addiction is a brain disease. It's a disease in the brain. And it's a disease that affects the part of the brain that controls behavior. And so when a person's addiction is out of control, their behaviors are out of control. People with addiction are absolutely responsible for their behaviors but they didn't try to get their disease. And so a person with addiction should not feel guilty for having the disease, but they should feel responsible for getting the help they need to treat their disease. And that's a really important distinction. Uh, education is key, awareness is key, being vigilant is key, and then leading people to the right resources is key as well. The really good news about the disease of addiction is if people survive, most get sober. That's, and, and that's not really understood by many, many people in, in society. So society has several different jobs. The community has several jobs. Um, one job, for the community is to not put up with addictive behavior. The way to do that is to uh, reinforce uh, social norms. Instead of making excuses for people who are drinking and drugging and getting out of control with their behavior, instead of making excuses for that out of control behavior, the key is to call people on the behavior and then make the link. Say, this was the behavior and you were using. It's the using that causes the behavior you need to get help for your using. We as a community need to face it. All of us need to work together to find a resolution uh, to this epidemic.